I mean, I think what makes that assumption about fossil fuels forever and oil forever wrong is that the alternatives have emerged and they work, they're affordable, and increasingly they're really appealing. Like an EV built in China with full you know, electrification of navigation and information and, and entertainment and eventually automation of self-driving, like that's all happening very quickly. That seems super appealing. You don't need gasoline to fuel that car. You've got electricity coming from solar renewables and other sources. And so that just feels like a much more appealing choice to make than to build an infrastructure based on fossil fuels because everybody knows at this point what happens when you become dependent on fossil fuels. And there are actually very few countries in the global south that produce their own oil and enough for domestic consumption. So they become importers, they become dependent, they become vulnerable to oil price shocks that happen regularly. And it, we know because it's such an interconnected industry that a conflict in the Middle East or in Ukraine or somewhere else has impacts on prices everywhere in the world that uses oil. So if you can find a way to fuel your economic development and not depend on oil, you can plan for the future and you have a much brighter future and a more stable one.